Welcome to the Control M Solution Series. This video will demonstrate how to upgrade Control M Enterprise Manager 9 to 9.0.18. The Control M upgrade process upgrades your current version of the Control M Enterprise Manager 9 to 9.0.18 on the same computer. This eliminates the need to migrate data and reduces downtime. To minimize downtime, Control M processes are up during the upgrade preparation process, which prepares all the required files. After the preparation completes, you are prompt to confirm the shutdown of Control M processes. After the processes are shut down, the upgrade begins and completes with minimum downtime. Here are some upgrade requirements and considerations. First, verify that your operating system and database software is compatible with the new version of Control M Enterprise Manager. Control M Enterprise Manager 9 Fixpack 1 or higher is required. After the upgrade completes, Control M Enterprise Manager is in compatibility mode. What does it mean? Older Control M clients that weren't upgraded can still work with the Upgrade Control M Enterprise Manager server. You can upgrade clients manually or with client distribution later. When compatibility mode is on, new features are disabled. Turning off compatibility mode enables new features in upgrade clients. After compatibility mode is turned off, Older clients will not be able to connect again. You cannot turn it back on, so it is very important that you turn it off until all your clients have been upgraded. Ensure that all of your existing Control M reporting facility reports and data are migrated and converted into Control M reports as described in Control M reporting facility migration in the Control M 9. .0.18 migration guide. Finally, after copying and extracting the DROST 9.0.18 file, please validate that you have at least 6 GB available in the EM9 file system. This space is required by the upgrade process. Here is my Control M Enterprise Manager 9. As you can see in my install versions file, I have Fixpack 5 installed. I have already extracted the DROST 9.0.18 file, so I proceed to run the setup.sh script. I enter Y to continue in non-graphical mode. The license agreement is displayed. I enter Y to accept it. Control M automatically collects information on your product usage patterns. This information helps us to identify trends, enhance Control M capabilities, and improve our products. The usage collection is optional. You can opt out at any time following the instructions in the disclaimer. For now, we press Enter to continue. Now I select the component that I'm going to upgrade. For this case, I select the Control M Enterprise Manager. I press Enter to continue. The upgrade has detected my Control M Enterprise Manager 9 Fixpack 5 on this computer. I press Enter to continue with the preparation. As we mentioned before, the preparation process prepares all the required files without the need of stopping the Control M EM processes. We can see the progress of the preparation processes with the messages that are displayed in the screen. It's very important to recall that my Enterprise Manager 9 is still running. At this point, I have not stopped any of the components or processes. The preparation is done, so now I'm asked if I'm ready to shut down the Control M Enterprise Manager components and continue with the upgrade. So I press enter to confirm this. Right now, the program is stopping the Control M processes and components to continue and finish with the upgrade.
So as you can see, the upgrade has been completed successfully with a minimal downtime at the end of the process. Now, if we check the install versions file, we can validate that our Control M Enterprise Manager has been upgraded to version 9.0.18. By running a check all command, I can confirm that all the Control M processes are components are up and running again. So now we can start using our new EM 9.0.18. That concludes this Control M Solutions video. Please see our knowledge base and YouTube channel for more videos like this. Thank you.